Hello party guests, it is Rachel here, um, Pampered Chef Director, and I just wanted to show you two new products that came out this spring season. One being our redesigned whipped cream maker, and the other one being our um, tube cake pan. So the whipped cream maker, if you have our previous version, looks pretty much exactly the same, just a different color, um, but our new one also has a decorator tip. So after you make your whipped cream, you can pop the bottom off, you can put that end on, and then you can squirt your whipped cream and decorate what you made. Um, so we will get going on the angel food cake. Give me just a moment to get my ingredients measured. Well, that didn't take me very long because I am making Betty Crocker's angel food cake, and my only ingredients are the mix and one and a third cups of water. So I'm going to put this into my stand mixer. There. And I have one and one third cups water measured in my measure all cup. Um, I love the measure all cup because it genuinely does measure all. So on here I can measure cups, ounces, tablespoons, teaspoons, and milliliters. Oh, so you can see it. Um, and then you do have the option with this one to do um, wet ingredients on one side and dry and sticky ingredients on the other. And you can move this up and down to get exactly the amount that you want. So these are fabulous. These are called the measure all cup. Anywho, I have got this in my mixer. And I'm gonna turn the power on. And I don't know how well that you all are gonna be able to see this, but I'm gonna go down to um, mix. No, it told me to beat. So I'm gonna choose the beat setting, which tells me to use this little paddle. If I were to use a different tool, or if I was supposed to, it would show me a whisk or it would show me the dough hook. Um, but it's gonna have me beat on low speed for 30 seconds. So I'm gonna go for 30 seconds. Now, if you do not have our deluxe stand mixer, you can get it for hosting. Oh my goodness, I should have done this on, ah, okay. I'm gonna do it on custom because otherwise it's gonna um, speed itself up and I don't want that. Okay, if you do not have the deluxe stand mixer, you can get one as a host for 60% off. So let your consultant know, me preferably. <laughs> Okay, so I need this to beat for 30 seconds on low and then for an additional minute on medium. So if I had used some of these presets, like what I started to do, um, if you set it on beat, it is going to incrementally speed up to the best speed for beating. Let me turn this up. And the reason that it does that start slow is so that you don't end up with a splatter of batter all over everything, which I am getting, I should have used my shield, hang on. Okay, in the last few seconds here, I'm going to just add some sprinkles to my batter. And hope that's enough. Okay, anywho, let me get you guys set up a little bit better here to see what's going on. So we've got the tilt to lift design going on here. Let me get my, come on, there we go. And I should have grabbed a handy dandy scraper. I just ordered three more of these scrapers because it seems like no matter what I do, they're always in the dishwasher. So they are a very nice thing to have. Okay, so we are going to put this in the tube cake pan. Nice thing about Pampered Chef's tube cake pan, and I never made Angie food cake before last week um, when I, <laughs> I got this pan. Um, but when you reverse it to let it cool, it's got these little legs. So I guess other people, when you make angel food cake, you have to let it cool over a glass bottle or something like that so that it can kind of like gravity help stretch out the cake. But this one has little legs on it so that you don't have to worry about that. So we are going to get our batter into the tube cake pan. And I'm hoping I didn't put the sprinkles in too, too early because I'm hoping that we can have some colorful bursts here throughout our angel food cake. My oven is preheated to 350 degrees. Um, the other tip is to make sure that your oven rack um, is all the way in the lowest position. This is a bit of a taller pan than you're probably usually baking with. Definitely taller than a bunk pan. Um, so you're gonna wanna make sure you've got plenty of room in the oven for that. All right, I'm gonna pop this into the oven for what does it say? Oh, like 37 to 47 minutes. We'll check back on that. 
All right, now while we wait for that, we will go ahead and make the whipped cream. So I'm gonna make sure my bottom is screwed on tight there. Um, I know that this is the top because the arrows line up, so I've got everything attached the right way. Um, if you can see, there is a fill line there so that I know just how much of the heavy whipping cream to put in. And then um, the recipe says one tablespoon of powdered sugar. I've been doing two. Um, I hear that more sugar helps it thicken up faster. I don't know if that's really true, but I like sweet whipped cream, so I am doing two. The other thing that I'm going to do, instead of vanilla in the recipe, I'm gonna use our new gourmet limoncello um, syrup that we came out with this season. So I'm gonna put a tablespoon of that in there. All right, and then I will just put the top on. And then there's a little plug. I'm gonna plug that up because we gotta create a little pressure in here. And then we're gonna pump. All right. Let's go. <laughs> I'm gonna pause you guys because I'm gonna pump until my arm gets tired, okay? All right, you guys, so I set a timer and I pumped for one minute. And let me show you, oh my gosh, that is thick. <laughs> whipped cream so once our angel food cake is done i will show you guys how to decorate with this so what i'm going to do is i'm going to scrape as much whipped cream into there as i can and i'm going to put this top on and pop it in the fridge okay so the cake is done i ended up baking it for 45 minutes um and now it just has to cool upside down and again these cute little legs are what is helping it float so that kind of the cake can stretch as it cools. So if you're watching this, just comment below and let me know the time and date that you watch. Um, more comments are gonna make sure more folks see this video. And if you're watching this during a party, I'll be giving you party points. All right, so I'm pretty sure this has cooled down. Feels cool to me. Um, the pan does come with a tool to help you loosen the cake from the pan. So I'm just gonna go all around the edges. Maybe all the way around, as well as around the post. Now, don't be too anxious, you guys, because this side of the cake is going to be the bottom of the cake at the end of, of the day here. And then let's see if I can remove from the pan. And then I'm just going to do the same thing around the bottom of the cake. To remove this I think I'm all the way am I all the way through I think so let's see I've got my cake stand here Ta-da! I made an angel food cake, you guys! And I did not forget that I have to frost it for you. Of course I didn't forget. Um, so I did cut myself a slice, and you can see what the sprinkles did. Again, probably should have put a few more, but I've got some cute bursts of color there. Now my whipped cream has been in the fridge, so I'm going to take the cap off there. I just love that the whipped cream maker itself doubles as a storage container. But when you're gonna use it for piping, you do have to put this rubber piece on the end here. Let's see if I can. I'm going to get that piece on. Ooh. Oh, I'm making a mess, you guys. I didn't unplug the, I wonder if that's why. Anywho, my whipped cream is runny. All right, see you guys. Okay, hoping to redeem myself. I gave it another 30 pumps or so. Gosh, guys, this seems super thick, so I don't know what happened. Maybe my refrigerator is not as cold as I thought it was. That's thick, you guys, okay. 
I'm going to get so messy doing this. But you guys are so worth it. Okay, so let me get this back in. If you know me, you know things don't always go quite as planned with me. I'm not going to grab another piece of cake because I don't want to eat two pieces of cake. There we go. Whipped cream. 